I do got a lot of plans for this one for do got a lot of plans. The wheels are dirty. Neighbors say I'm getting too much paper. I got See, I think we got one. Yeah, 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 What's up you guys man, it's your boy Real to Real man back in here with another video Hey man, say man, hey man, it's your boy man Real to Real Y'all already know what it is man uh, Man, just been a long, long week for your boy man But like I say man, we're gonna try to keep this positive energy Try to keep our energy up man Try not to let anything get us down just stay moving, just stay motivated, just stay dedicated to the grind, you know. Man, I just, I got so much stuff playing, you guys, man, and I just want to make sure I execute everything right. Um, shout out to my boy Camel Cat, man, for that new purchase, man. We talked on the phone, we spoke about something. I ain't going to let you guys know what he got, you know. He going to have to let y'all know. Uh, but my boy got something crazy coming, man. So, you know, I'm just glad I can be there to help people and uh, help them along the way, man. I don't want to see nobody fail. I want to see everybody succeed. And I ain't going to let nobody put, put themselves in a bad position or, you know, get themselves into a bad opportunity. You know what I'm saying? So I want people to have good opportunities, better positions in life and all that, man. And I'm going to just stay on my grind and stay focused, too. I'm just going to have to just get out and move a little bit more. Know what I'm saying? Just so I can get that good, exciting footage. You know what I'm saying? Like I remember them days, man, when I can just go outside and I just, man, I, it don't even matter what happened. I'm just going to get up with the fellas and we just filming, having fun in the cars and stuff like that. And it's like, whatever happened to that, man? But so much of greed. That's what happened. You know what I'm saying? So much of. Uh, People want fame too much, man. Greed and fame, man, is the most two evilest things, man. And it's like, dang, why everybody had to do that. You know what I'm saying? Like, everybody could just be grinding, making bread, getting money, and having fun, man. But everybody wanted to go their separate ways. Everybody want to do their own thing, man, which everybody got to grow and elevate, man. But, man... You know, you make, I always tell people, you make more money together than apart, than separated. But nobody wanted to believe me, man. Everybody just wanted to do them and wanted to just be greedy. But at the end of the day, man, we just out here and, uh, man, I, you just have to get it popping by yourself, man. It's one lonely world, man. They said it's lonely at the top and I damn sure be feeling it sometimes. You know what I'm saying? But it, what's so crazy is, you know what I'm saying? You know, I don't be just having people to film with and stuff like that, man. I have to make my own moves. I have to get out there and grind on my own. Ain't nobody, don't nobody around me do YouTube or nothing like that, you know. And, and what make it so bad, you know, is, you know, you try to help people to get on YouTube and so you can have people to film with and stuff like that. But people turn on you so much, man. That's just how it is, you know. That's just how it is. Uh, but, you know, man, I, one thing I do appreciate, I appreciate my Chicago brothers, you know what I'm saying? Uh, CJ Stunner, you know what I'm saying? Cooley, um, Martin, uh, Tunchi, you know, Swer Swervo, you know, AB, like, everybody up there, you know what I'm saying? You know, if I, I left out your name, I ain't trying to leave out your name, but it's just, you know, it, it, it's, you know, man, I appreciate them more than anything man like all of us stayed down till we came up you know what i'm saying like i always tell people man you gotta wait your turn your turn will come you know what i'm saying your turn will come you just gotta stay down until you come up i'm a li living witness of that that's why i be so humble that's the reason why I'm always myself because I'm down. I ain't saying I'm up. I'm down. I'm still waiting on that come up where everybody thinking, oh, they up there on that certain level. No, I'm still waiting on my turn. And the thing about me is I'm patient. 
but I ain't got no time to waste. So I still, I can't go slow because I want to go slow. I have to move fast because I don't want to waste no time. The thing is time that you waste is time lost. You can't never get that time back. You'll never be able to. That time would never come back to you. It would never. So you got to get out there. You got to go get it. You got to grind. You can't slow down. Don't let nobody see you sweat. Because you going to sweat. And you going to sweat hard. Until you got to come out your shirt. But that don't mean nobody got to see it. Or nobody got to know. But me... I always show everything, good, bad, ugly, whatever. I show everything. I'm real. And ain't nobody can change that about me. I'm always be like this. I'm always be myself. I'm always let y'all know what's going on in my life and what's, what I'm going through. You know what I'm saying? Because I feel like when I tell people what I'm going through, it helped them out of their situation be like, dang, okay, well, maybe what I'm going through ain't as bad because this man is going through this. You know what I'm saying? So that's the reason why I let people know what I'm going through. And uh, it's just one of them things, man. I just I just love my real supporters, the people that really support me, the people that come on the channel and hit the like button before the video even start, the people that always in the comments section letting me know that I'm doing good, that they appreciate me, they appreciate the content. You know, I, I, I'm grateful for all them people, man. You know, I really love that, you know, about people. You know, you do got the people that come over and just say whatever they want to say. They say that because they ain't got no life of their own. They say that because they hating on the life you're living. They say that because they want to do what you do. They say that because they want to be in your position. They say that because they want to walk a mile in your shoes. That's the reason why. They stay down there and they gonna stay down forever. Cause hating on the next man, God would not bless you. God would not bless you for hating on the next man. He won't. And he gonna make you feel it. So that's why me, I ain't hating on nobody. I want everybody to succeed. I want everybody to win. That's the reason why I always reached out and helped people come up. I always did that no matter how long I've been on YouTube I always reached out to smaller people to help them come up the only thing I got in return from a lot of stuff that I did do was stabs in the back you know what I'm saying a lot of stabs in the back and so that's the reason why a lot of big youtubers don't even step out their comfort zone no more and try to meet new people or try to help people no more like that too much because they got that stab in the back that they always you know kept on their shoulder so you know but me i'm still willing to help people you know what i'm saying people want to collab with me you can collab with me i'm doing all collabs this weekend and this week coming up so if people want to collab with me just hit me up you know what i'm saying it's gonna come with a price be cash out ready but I'm still willing to help people. I'm still willing to help people get out there and figure this stuff out and figure this thing out called YouTube because it's hard to figure out. You know what I'm saying? Me, I kind of got it down to a T. Thing is, I know what I'm doing. I make money if my views low. I make money if my views high. That's what people have to understand. And I got the formula for that. I got the strategy behind it all. But the thing is, it's no cheap no cheat code with youtube is none you have to grind and stay consistent it's no cheat code you know what i'm saying but it's other things that you should know you know and that's what i talk to people about when they do collabs with me i'm not always recording everything i talk about with someone i'm usually giving them game while i'm recording or when i got the camera off i'm giving them all the game to youtube you know but that's the thing. Some people take it in, some people don't. You know, just one of them things. It is what it is. You know, some people you waste your time on, some people you don't. They listen, they actually listen. But uh, I ain't finna talk y'all ear off. I know I, I keep going. You know, a lot of people be enjoying these type conversations and stuff like that. Cause I get it a lot. Like people be like, man, 
I'm glad you be putting this type stuff up in your videos because we actually be wanting to hear that type stuff and want to hear that you guys are not robots out there. You guys do actually uh, care about people, got feelings, and y'all actually work and grind and do everything else. So right now, um, I'm over here at the billet stop uh, about to get ready and so they can get started on everything and uh, get everything going. Hopefully it'll be today. Um, it's gonna get dark real quick, y'all. Y'all know I be in grind mode. Y'all know I be trying to hustle up two videos in a day. Like I just been in pure, pure grind mode. Like non-stop grind mode. Like just going and going and going. Here, there, back and forth, here, there, there, here. Man, so many and so much going on. <laughs> so many different locations. So, so much time in a day, you know. There's not enough time in a day. But yeah, man, let's get up out this car. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah, I'm in Big Boy Red Eye, man. Make sure this thing, man, don't be brighting up on me. I, I see how this, I don't know why this lens been doing that lately. It been getting so bright, let me, but it been getting so bright, man. The car is dirty. I gotta get Red Eye washed up and stuff. Definitely gotta do that. What the? So yeah, I had to hook up my, side marker light and Isaac forgot to hook it back up when he had to bump off doing them lights and stuff but yeah man my car dirty than the mud man I gotta get it washed again I have to peel this white stick off man it's supposed to bend head matter of fact I need some something that match my damn car Gonna take this off real quick. Uh, give me a second, y'all. Right, I gotta take it off both sides. I don't know, just throw off the car to me with that white, man. The next day. Hey, you guys, man. So, I had a whole lot going on. Uh, the car is not gonna be ready uh, too soon. Well, the thing is, you guys, I didn't want him to rush nothing and I don't wanna rush no video out or nothing like that. And I didn't wanna put nobody on no time crunch. So, I told him take his time with the last vehicle that was on the machine. I know I didn't record nothing or anything around there, but um, I just wasn't, my head wasn't there, you guys. Like, I know, I know, you know. I know sometimes stuff get hard and we gotta stay strong through everything, but you know what I'm saying? My mind just wasn't there, y'all. And uh, I appreciate all the love. I appreciate all the condolences. I appreciate you guys, man, you guys have tremendously just changed my life with just that last video so you know like i always say you know health is wealth and uh we got to be able to enjoy life and we got to be able to get out here focus a little bit harder um uh, gain our strength back and do all this so you know today is my journey to get myself back in shape i've been motivated you guys just motivated me to make sure that i stay right here on this platform and I give you guys all the energy that I can to make great videos so today will be the first day of me getting back in the gym and uh, I'm gonna take you guys through the journey with me man we're gonna make this an everyday thing I'm not gonna slack I'm not gonna miss no days no matter how tired I am no nothing and um, I don't know I probably supposed to be going back to work sometime soon so uh, like I told you guys it was just only temporary you know, so I can get myself back to where I needed to be mentally and physically and, you know, on my YouTube platform. So, um, yeah, but I just want to talk to you guys about this situation, man. One thing that we got to stop doing um, as the people of this earth, we have to stop um, killing off each other. You know what I'm saying? And I'm saying that because I know I've been through bad stuff in my life and everything like that, but we just gotta put an end to it, man. It's just way too much going on. And uh, life is precious and life is short. So, you know, we wanna teach the youth that it's a better way because right now, the youth the youth is worse than they ever been in life. Like we could say our era was the baddest, this era was the baddest, 
But now, man, the the younger generation that's coming up now, they don't they don't really know no better. They only know, you know, get out of jail free cards, you know. So, man, we just got to show them a little bit more, and we got to teach them how to do things a little differently. So, you know, my journey on to try to teach the youth um, something different is by me going to exercise every day, get my mind, you know, back intact, you know. When you exercise, your mental get back right, you guys. So um, just always know that, man, if you're going through problems, you're going through certain situations, man, just go exercise. Get it off your head. When I was locked up and I was in jail, the only thing I did was exercise the whole time I was in there. So it, it helps you. It helps get your focus back. It helps keep your mind at ease. It helps generate, um, it help generate the, the help that you had when you was um younger you know so like i say um everything on the channel is not gonna be about cars uh, too much more every i'm just gonna be incorporating a whole lot of footage man taking you guys around showing you guys the scenery uh showing you guys dallas um uh, just going in the nitty gritty so just showing you guys everything that Dallas have to offer and other cities have to offer. Like, I'm just going to be doing my, most of my traveling stuff. I'm going to be doing that and just going to different places, man, and talking with people and seeing how their neighborhood is and, you know, how different things is from other cities. And just, you guys, just a whole lot, man. I just want to do a whole lot, man. I don't want to get caught up on the just being able to vlog about one particular thing and that's a car you know i gotta live life and man we gotta live life together like i say let's help the youth um look for a different way out than robbing stealing killing and i know you guys i know everybody be like how can you talk about this and that how can you talk about that when your intro song says this and that where the intro song is about to get changed so you know the thing is i still always want lit intro song but i y'all do have a point and i i accept certain criticism like a lot of people think i don't i do accept certain criticism that's why i am working on to make a a new intro for my channel you know what i'm saying i was just trying to wait on the wheels to get done but i don't know i probably don't do that now you know i probably just go in with it and just go ahead and do it and do a new intro so um we'll see um after i get back in california and um i'm gonna hit um mo up and see exactly when you know the material gonna get in so i can go ahead and get my wheels cut out and get everything finished and stuff so um we just got a whole lot coming we got a whole lot to do but right now let's go ahead and uh get to this gym I know y'all ain't seen the cars in a minute. Y'all, I know y'all ain't been seeing the AMG for a while, so you know I do got a lot of plans for this one. For do got a lot of plans. The wheels are dirty. Yeah, that brake dust just be killing us over here. Even on mine, you know, the brake dust just kills you. But uh, yeah, gotta take the trash out too. <laughs> it's trash day, y'all. So let me take this trash out and uh. We're going to see y'all once we get around here to the gym. Like I say, you guys uh, enjoy this journey. It's a new journey for me. You know, I used to go to the gym all the time, but now, big boy stomach got to go. <laughs> I ain't playing around no more. Then my face, I needed to go back down. You know, my face was not, you know, this fat. So <laughs> I got to get it back down, man. I, I don't look like myself anymore. So you guys, when you... You when you feel good, you look good. When you look good, you feel good. So, hey, that's my motto right now. So uh, I'm gonna catch you guys in a minute. Peace. And another thing, you guys, man, I do want to send my condolences up to Get Busy Drizzy up there in Chicago. His family and friends and everything around him, uh, everybody around him, you know, that was hurt by the tragic thing that happened to him. Uh, you know, rest in peace. Uh, get busy drizzy i actually don't know if i met the guy or not but i probably have um just probably don't remember 
but I did see them in Sugar Man videos all the time, so um, I just wanted to send my uh, condolences up there to his family in Chicago, uh, his family and friends in the Joliet area, Chicago, whichever area, you know what I'm saying? And uh, yeah, peace and blessings to you. Uh, everybody gonna miss you. I've been seeing it going around, so you know, you know, your story lives on, so. So you guys might have made it up into the gym right now. I told you guys I'm about to start hitting the gym again to get back in shape, man. Health is wealth, so got my wife in here to join me. And we just finna go on this uh, exercising journey. Y'all stay tuned.
Oh, y'all, I'm up in here dying, man. Killing myself. Oh, my Jesus. Man, been a long time. And I can feel it, and I can tell. It been a really, really long time, man. But sometimes y'all gotta keep pushing, and just keep pushing, and just keep pushing, and just never give up. See, when it comes to losing weight, it's not, well, it's about how you eat and stuff like that. You know, your diet or whatever. But at the end of the day, it's all about consistency. So consistency will take you a long way. And that's just like with YouTube. And I tell people, don't worry about views and stuff on YouTube. Worry about being consistent. If you stay consistent with the good amount of content, you're gonna automatically grow and make your money. It's not all about subscriber count. That's what a lot of people gotta realize. It's not all about subscriber count. You get your money off your views, and how many ads people watch. And so, you know, you can have a, a video that don't get that many views, but if it's long enough, it's gonna still accumulate the amount of ad revenue as a person with a short video with a good amount of views. So, like I always tell people, if you stay consistent, you gonna always outweigh the ones who not consistent. Because at the end of the day, when you're putting up videos every single day, you're accumulating money every day while another person is just getting money once or twice a week. Even though they're accumulating views, you're accumulating more views and more ad revenues because you're posting every day other than just two days a week. You're posting seven days a week. So when you look at everything, and it all boils down to this. You'll make more money or you'll lose more weight. Yeah, if you guys stay consistent, you guys will make it. Um, you guys better go a long way, you know. And um, I'm about to get ready and um, dip up out of here. Go grab me a bite to eat. And then um, take it on in. So I'll catch you guys once I get back to the crib or once I get to somewhere to get me something to eat. And I'll check back in with y'all before I end the video off. But I appreciate you guys. But man, listen to everything that I'm telling you guys um, throughout my videos for now on. Um, it ain't all about being rich and who can uh, buy the, the most cars and who can fix up a car better than whoever and stuff like that, man. It's just always about enjoying life while you're doing your passion and watch how life um, pat you on the back and everything start looking upwards for you and everything gonna start going the way that you want it to and the way that you planned on it to go and it's just gonna be all around better for you so um, get your workout in let's do this together let's do this journey together and um, let's keep playing ball man catch y'all in a minute peace one hour later. Okay, you guys, man, your boy has made it back to the crib. I had when they just got me some Chipotle or whatever. Dang, excuse me. Yeah, I went and got some Chipotle. And, uh, man, just try to start this healthy little journey. I know Chipotle probably ain't the most healthiest thing, but it's better than all this other food I've been eating. So, um, yeah, I appreciate you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I know this one, the average video. Things gonna get better, but you know, I just got so much going on, so much on my mind right now that I didn't even, I, I, I couldn't get out and get no car videos and stuff like that. I just got so much going on in my life and um, I don't wanna put that energy off on you guys. So, you know, I just better off, you know, giving you guys a motivational video um, other than a car video that I probably wasn't gonna be into. But uh, we got more exciting and lit videos to come, so. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel. Uh, join the real gang. Join the team. Join the family. Make sure you guys follow me on Instagram. And because we got to get those followers on up, man. And uh, make sure you guys enter the CA Corvette giveaway. The link is down in the description. Um, we do have a Black Friday sale going on right now. So if you guys want to enter that, make sure you enter it um, 
before Tuesday because it will be off before Tuesday and back to the regular deals. So we got some amazing deals going on right now. Uh, all the way to tomorrow to Cyber Monday. And uh, make sure you guys go enter, man. Chance to win your CA Corvette or $50,000 cash, man. But I appreciate you guys and all the support. Y'all already know what time it is. Your boy, Real to Real. Hey, man, say, man. Hey, man, it's your boy, man. Real to Real, man. The like button, that subscribe button, that share button. Go ahead, bust it down. I'm out of here like last year, man. Peace. Neighbors uh... say I'm getting too much paper. I got Pinch look, bitch, I got that cat in my pocket, yeah, pinch look, and I'm doing the dance, all the lot, yeah, pinch look. Nigga, this a hot bust this shit, I ain't come with no pinch look. And I got little friends with me, and he ride with a third of clip. Nigga, don't get your ass flipped, fuck where I get your ass dipped. I'm clear with these niggas, they all get killed. Yeah, pinch look, my nigga shiesty with them sticks, so don't get popped, nigga. Get your knock, nigga. She popped the sand, the bitch sleeping. My coat too fast, police to see me.